Toads misses, Super Paul misses. Wolfie kills one of them. Oh shit, Christina's using her Uzi. Aces too. Um, we're gonna run closer. Three, six feet? No, we're gonna run closer. I don't know if we had to fight these guys. Well, they fought back, didn't they? You damn hooligans! Blaster misses! Captain Rhodes murders one of them! Christina kills another one. Super Paul reloads. Ooh, gear! Fruit and a knife. Um... I think everybody's pretty full up. Some cash and some knives. Knife to meet you. This looks like a private club. An eyeball appears in a hole in the wall. And you hear, what's the password? Poopy. Blow off! Apparently that wasn't it. Oh, there's that hooker. Oh, she didn't bug us. We're gonna get too close to her. More leather jerks! Leather jerks? I really am sick of y'all. We're just going to the store. Super Paul hits one. Wolfie hits him. Ace finish. Oh, man. I gotta switch them out of Uzis. In fact, I think actually. I gotta go to the library after this. Uh, let's radio high command. Nobody's got enough for promotions? Alright, Wolfie, let's see. What can we sell of yours? Uh, we have an extra knife. What are you using right now? You're using the M19 rifle. You have a second M19. We don't need two M19s. You don't need the extra knife because you use a sledgehammer. Super Paul, let's see what you got to sell. You got a knife you can sell. Oh, he's got rockets. I forgot about those. We picked those up last time. It's been like a week. Man, we are just full of um, weapons and stuff. Sell the fruit. We'll get plastic explosives. Let's see if we can get Christina to sell anything. I don't know if she'll let us. She's got a ton of 9mm clips. What about Ace? Man, he's got a ton of stuff too. We're doing really good. I don't know if we're doing good enough to go to Vegas, though. Let's sell this fruit. That's the high pace <laughs> Paul stream. I'm going to be a fruit seller. All right, that's everything we need. Oh, wait, do you have anything good to buy? I wish he had a rad suit to buy. Alright, we're probably good with that. Anybody need to reload? Oh shit, Wolfie, did I sell? Oh, I sold the right... Shit, I sold the one she was using. The M19. Good me. That's right, Captain Rhodes has an extra M19. We'll give that to Wolfie. Because he's using the NATO AR now. Alright, Christine, we're going to have you switch back to the 9mm pistol. We'll probably have Ace do the same thing, because I don't want to waste... I think he's got a... Yeah, he's got a pistol. I don't want to waste all that 9mm ammo. Alright, 
right, I think we're ready to roll. Let's run up to the library. See if we can get anybody skilled up. I think the library is this way. Did we go down there? We must have gone down there. It's open. Get the fuck out of here! Wait, we have a new blood staff. I think that's where the armory is down there. Quit trying to beat us, you jerk-offs. This town is full of jerks. Oops, I don't want to run. Just attack. Blaze Captain Rhodes Rhodes miss. Super Paul hits one of the jerks, killing them. What a jerk. Bloodstaff verification table. Place Bloodstaff on table to verify. So we... We'll try this blood staff. We should have the blood staff of the. How do I do it? Oh, I think it's use item. The blood staff of uh, whoever that bad cult leader was. Verification okay. Please remove blood staff. Um, what did we do? is verified I didn't see anything else open up down here though uh, we'll save it a quick second can I do that again it's verified but what is the point of having it verified somebody want it verified? I don't think anybody asked for it. There's the armory. What's this building? Is this a police station? Who the hell's this asshole? Sam, I got the Use item. We got the blood staff from the cult leader. Oh, he don't care about that. I'd love to break into there, but I don't want to get all the cops mad at us. Nope. To the library. Oops. Fuck balls. To the library. I'm going to check out a book. Uh, let's see. Blaster's got one skill point. Captain Rhodes got two. I want a point in... I don't know what confidence is good for. I thought there was a skill for opening safes. Let's see, lockpick. We've not really needed that lockpick so much, though. What about sleight of hands for? We're going to give Wolfie a point in gamble. Oh, maybe I didn't have enough of that. Maybe I needed two. Quiet, please. You're in a center of higher learning. Who wants to enter? Oh, we, we'll give us... Wait, who's this for? Captain Rhodes? We'll give him a point in assault rifle because he's using one. Give him. And then Blaster, we'll give you a point. Oh, that's not going to work. All right, let's roll the hell out of here. Ah!
From the depths of the wasteland appears a hostile avis for adversary. I can read two slithering iguanas. Just what iguanas, we're not wusses anymore. He's like, that's not what I heard. <laughs> so we shoot them. Don't you badmouth me, you slithering iguana. Shit, I should have got my guys healed. Didn't we close this place down? Ah! Oh. Killer robots. All right, we're we're not gonna rest here. I was just curious, which was stupid of me. Blaster snaps a shot. Hitting the robot for 17. Paul hits one for 5. Uh-oh. Blaster attack this thing. I guess will be some good experience, maybe? Mayor Pedro's gun spits lead and one killer is stitched full of bullets for 21 points of damage, killing them. Mayor, Mayor Pedro got a ton of experience for that. Guards? Now guards bug us? After all the other things we did in this place? Blaster misses. Captain Rhodes shoots and kills the guard. But they get a return shot. Hitting Mayor Pedro, knocking him out. Your cult sucks. Goodbye. Not quite sure why um, radiation wasn't showing up correctly there. I think we can rest down here in the ammo bunker. Seems like a nice place to rest. Sure, why not? I don't think the cult ever found their second in command. He's right down there, dead in the corner. should have seen if there was a medic skill we could have leveled up. I think I might have screwed that up. I mean, assault rifle will be useful for us. Fortunately, we can't shoot bandages at us. Doctor, shoot me with your healing bullets. Christina and Blaster need to get healed up. Everyone else is ready to go. Blaster was pretty beat up. Oh, I'm wrong. Christina and A still had a few more points to get, too. I think there are three places left on the map to visit that we haven't visited yet. I mean, we visited one of them in a playthrough that we had to go back on. Las Vegas... The Citadel, and then there's... Oh, balls. There's the city of the Northeast that's surrounded by radiation that we've not gone into. Alright, there's Vegas. Three desert, desert dwellers appear at 14 feet. Oh. I'm beautiful. My mother says so. So you are. Thank you. Blister shoots at the ugly man and misses. Super Paul hits. Wolfie hits. Christina hits and Ace hits. I don't think they did any damage to us. Uh, let's let's radio HQ. See if the mayor. No. 
Get out of my way, you slithering iguanas. We're just trying to investigate. Super Ball hits and kills an iguana. Is that the only one? A wild canine appears at 40 feet. Maybe he was friends with the iguana. How dare you hit Charlie? Ah, we were out for his bachelor party. It went horrible. How far does it go up here? Okay, let's go to the edge of the map. Oh, shit. Mayor Pedro passed out because it was warm. Does Mayor Pedro not have a canteen? I looked some things up, and canteens do matter. When it says it's very hot down here. Oh, shit, he doesn't. If your players have a canteen, they're fine because they have water. If they don't have a canteen, they will lose hit points. The mayor does not have a canteen. I could have sworn I got him one. It must have been Ace I was thinking about. It's like, can I have a little water, dudes? Nope. So thirsty. <laughs> Oh, we're going to have to reload the save because of that. Okay, I'm going to go down to Needles and buy him a canteen. Go to the store. I forgot about the hot dog stand. This guy won't wake up. No use waking him up. He's been asleep for weeks. The vendor has bottles on a bandolier around his chest. Want some snake squeezes? Best around for 15 bucks. Yeah, let's buy some. Somebody's got to be able to carry these. There we go. So I think we bought some. Yeah. We can go give them to the hobo. That's always fun to do. I need a canteen, bro. Uh, Mayor Pedro. Canteen. Okay, good. So we won't have this dumbass pass out on us like before. Oh! What the hell is this? Did we not go into the mine? Two underground just appear at 10 feet. How did I miss that before? <laughs> oh no. Oh, I hope this isn't like when we shot people in a high pool. Captain Rose kills one. Super Paul kills one. Super Paul, why don't we have you reload? And then Wolfie. Get out that sledgehammer. Let's bust open this door. The old shack is made of weather-beaten adobe. The door of rotting wood and rusting iron. Of course, it's locked. The dirt floor is covered with dry desert weeds. Looks like someone or something has been sleeping here. Rad rats? They're not rad at all. Blaster shoots at a rad rat and misses. Captain Road shoots at one. Two. Super Paul kills one. Wolfie kills one. Christina kills one. Ace kills one. Mayor Pedros kills one. 
guess there's like one left? One or two? Captain Rhodes fires, shooting a rat rat in the face, blowing his face off. A glow viper appears at two feet. Oh, please don't be venomous. Shoot it before it can inject us with poison. Captain Rhodes hits it, Super Paul hits it, killing it. So much better than we used to be. Ooh, loot! $50 in cash and a rope. We'll have the mayor take the rope. Ooh, a locked strong box? Shh, I don't think any of us have lock pick. We'll save it a quick second. Let's see if we can just smash it open. Hopefully there's hopefully it's not like somebody's China doll collection. <laughs> Something fragile, porcelain figures. Ooh, Wolfie smashes it open. There are gas masks inside in a rope? Huh. Cape Critters at 14 feet, eight of them. A gas mask. My RPG senses tell me that we're probably going to need those if there's four of them there. The Cape, Cape, Cape Critter bowls into Super Paul, but his armor absorbs the damage. Another one pounces onto Wolfie, but her armor absorbs the damage. Killed a bunch of them right there. I'm Ratty McGee! You're gonna die, Ratty McGee! Blaze turns Captain Rhodes miss. Super Ball hits. Wolfie hits. Christina hits. Whoa, there's a dead lady right there. Or she had one hell of a period. Oh, here's the skeleton dude. The mountain is made of sandstone, but still very strong. There's a whole bunch of dead people down here. Attacked Rubble Fanger. Blaster misses. Captain Rhodes misses. Super Paul misses. Wolfie misses. Christina misses. Ace misses. Pedro hits. Doesn't seem to be mi moving. Blaster misses. Captain Rhodes misses. They both... Oh, Super Paul misses. Wolfie hits for 18 points of damage, killing it. <laughs> little people? Oh, wait. Can we hire them? There's 14 little people. I don't want to hurt these people. Oh, the little people attacked us. Okay, it's on then. We tried to run away peacefully. If you want some, we'll throw down. Blaster misses. Captain Road misses. Super Paul kills one of the little people. Wolfie hits one. Christina hits one. Ace's weapon jams. Mayor Pedro kills two of them. Mayor Pedro's a killing machine. Blaster and Captain Rhodes both miss the little people, but Wolfie doesn't. Shooting one in the face. Ending it. Alright, let's check out this dead person. Savage creatures of the mines want your blood. Nine drools appear. Do they, like, lure people in here? <laughs> I represent the lollipop graveyard. Wolfie hit. Everybody else missed, though. Well, we'll try shooting again. Captain Rhodes misses. Super Paul misses. Christina misses. Ace misses. Pedro misses. Blaster and Wolfie reload. Fuck it. We're going to run a little closer to him. 
Hopefully we'll get better shots off. Try some burst fire. Blaster hits, whoa, three of them. Blaster killed three of them with just like <laughs> Super Paul kills one. I don't use a lot of burst fire when we don't need to because it wastes ammo. But that worked out good. Blaster misses, Captain Rhodes misses. Super Paul hits killing one, Wolfie hits killing one. Ace and Christina kill them too. You find the half-eaten remains of what might have been a human. Gear is scattered all around the area. Now, what do we got here? Cash. I don't really care about the clay pot or a hand mirror. Savage creatures of the mind want your blood. Little people. <laughs> Little people come out to attack us? Just because I took those pots off those other guys? Of course, we're the ones who just invaded here. Blaster kills one. Captain Rhodes kills one. Super Paul nails one. Wolfie hits one. Oh, they knocked. The little people beat Mayor Pedro unconscious. How dare you attack the mayor? Blaster kills one of the little people. Take the ca oh, there's a grenade. Please tell me somebody can take the grenade. Okay, Blaster got the grenade at least. Two drools appear at 20 feet. Blaster shoots and misses. Captain Rose is the same. But Super Paul and Wolfie are stone cold shooting and murdering those poor creatures. Ooh, more gear. I don't think we have room for it. TNT! Oh, Super Paul had room for TNT. Seven jewels appear at 22 feet. You know, we're just gonna open up with some burst fire. We show them who meets boss. Blaster misses. Captain Rhodes, well, raked one of them, killing them. Wolfie kills one. We just broke into these poor creatures' home. <laughs> we're the Desert Rangers. Stop living. Blaster, Captain Rose, Wolfie misses. Christina hits one killing it. Ace misses. Pedro misses. Super Paul reloads. It's the coolest reload of all time. Oh, it's really cool how he reloaded. Blaster and Captain Rose both miss. Super Paul misses. Wolfie doesn't, though. She hits and kills one. Oh, just die, you stupid things. Super Paul hit. Wolfie hit one. Christina hit one. There we go. Mayor Pedro's killed one. Mayor Pedro's has been pretty good. What is this area all about? Hmm. What about these... There's a lot of rubble on the floor, as if someone has been chipping the walls recently. The rocks look strange. Um, uh, Blaster, do you have perception? No. Captain Rhodes, do you have perception? Maybe if we try it here? Maybe we could use some TNT on it? Let's see. Let's have Wolfie reload first of all. And then Blaster, you should have some TNT or something. No, I want to um, use it? 
doesn't seem to work. How, what do we do here then? Uh, do we have any other skills we could use? Attributes? Wait, IQ. Blaster's really smart. Maybe Blaster can IQ it. Nope. One shadow claw appears at 30 feet. I don't know what the hell that is, but it sounds scary. Blaster shoots and misses. Captain Rhodes hits it. Only two points of damage. Super Paul hit it for only two points of damage. Luckily, Wolfie hit it for 13. And Mayor Pedros nailed it for 16, killing it. Mayor Pedros has got a ton of experience. He's got to be ready to level up. Super Paul, you've achieved the rank of Lance Corporal Super Paul. All right, I want to make my dexterity better. You get two adventure points to distribute to your... Mayor Pedros has gone up in level two. We'll give him one for dexterity. We'll give him one for luck. Awesome. Two of our guys got promotions. Man, there's so many people chopped up here. Ton of lizards. Sorry, lizards. Tunnel snakes rule, not tunnel lizards. Eat a dick. Blaster, Captain Rhodes, both shoot and miss. Super Paul hits, but only for one point of damage. What do you do, like, shoot off his finger down? I shot off one of your scales. Eat that. Tunnel lizard. Blaster and Captain Rhodes both misses. Super Paul misses. Luckily, Wolfie hits. And Mayor Pedros is just wrecking these things. Which I'm kind of surprised because he was such a wuss trying to defend the town he had. <sighs> you find the half eaten remains of what might have been a human being. Five undergrounders. Get out of my way, undergrounders. We're just exploring. Whoa, Blaster fires and kills one of them. Captain Ro oh, I feel bad when we just shoot these. We just wreck these undercrowders. Another half-eaten remains. Shaft slider. Whoa, lewd. Christina hits the sh sh shaft slider. Nobody else? Seem to. I wonder if there's gonna be a mission where we have to come back here and get the stones out of the cave. Yeah, it's like level one D and D. It's one problem when you play uh, level one characters. It's so easy to have characters die. That or maybe I wasn't a nice enough DM. Ah, oh, get out of here, Tunnel Lizard! You know, we're just gonna run for that Tunnel Lizard. <sighs> we're gonna run from those. I wanna check out this body. Another half eaten remains. Well, lizards, I didn't want to kill you, but you want to get up on me like that. We're going to have to do it. Christina's weapon jam. Super Paul hits. Wolfie kills one of them. A Slytherin lizard bulls into the Mayor Pedro's knocking him unconscious. Uh-oh. Good thing we have this armor. Uh, Captain Rhodes, you need to reload. These lizards are actually doing a number on us. Wolfie reload. Christina attack. Oh, her weapon's jammed. Only a couple of us are going to get shots off this turn. Blaster misses. Super Paul hits, killing one of them. Ace hits. Mayor Pedros 
burns the clip, and six slithering lizards are raked for 174 points of damage. The mayor just wrecked them all. Hopefully he's not going through too much ammo that way. Uh, reload. You can give one of these to the mayor. You can give another one of these to the mayor. Oh, we can't carry any more. Never mind. Wait, did we check out this one? I don't think we did. One blind mind crawler appears at 40 feet. I don't care. Oh, I, we gotta go that way. We're gonna run right at it. There seems to be more of that kind of rock by this dead person. Blaster, Captain Road, Super Paul all missed the blind mind crawler, but not Wolfie. She shoots it for 17 points of damage. Another half-eaten remains of a human. There's a lot of rubble on the floor as if someone has been chipping at the walls recently. The rocks look strange. What are they all mining? Oh, God damn it. I wonder if we can climb over that. Uh, Captain Rhodes, attribute. No, that's uh, skill. Passageway is completely blocked with rubble. It would take explosives to get through. Well, that seems wasteful. But we have explosives, so fuck yeah, we're doing it. TNT! Cave in, the explosives brought down the roof. This didn't help anything, it just made it worse. There was like 11 slithering lizards right there. Oh, I missed the Captain Rose got knocked unconscious. I don't know if that was in the fight or in the cave we just caused. Trying to blow shit up. Blaster shoots! For, uh, a burst, killing two of the lizards. Super Paul shoots a lizard in the face, killing it. Wolfie shoots another one, killing it. Christina damages one, and Ace shoots another one, killing it. Still a handful of them, though. I forgot what we were doing in this chunk of the world. I forgot that we were trying to go to Rail Nomad so we could give some more booze to Boozy McGee. Uh-oh, is that how we came in? Cave critters. This is our new home. We're gonna be the little people soon in this cave. Cave critters attack, but none of them do any damage because our armor is way too awesome. Man, that armor is awesome. Hopefully this will help us uh, level up a little bit more for when we go to Vegas. Tunnel lizard appears at 30 feet. Run right at it. <sighs> Pretend you're big. I guess those are used against bears, they say. Blaster and Captain Rhodes miss. Super Paul hits it but doesn't do any damage. Does that mean he even hit it? <laughs> yeah, I hit it. Sure you did, me. Another half-eaten person. We already saw that one. Well, I guess we gotta go back the way we came. Unless... Rad rats appear at 14 feet. 
I don't know if right up there, if we can go to the left. Can't. I don't know if we can go to the left right there or not. We'll try it. Blaster misses. Captain Rhodes misses. Super Paul murders one. Wolfie kills one. Christina kills one. We're going to have dead rats for days. Who wants some rat stew? Captain Rhodes fires at one of the rad rats. Smattering his blood everywhere. Uh oh. You know what, Blaster? Wait, what are your skills? You got a skill on assault rifle, so we want to keep you with that. Wolfie, let's have you reload. Run a little low on 7.62. Captain Rhodes, what are your skills? Clip pistol? Oh, you have a. Assault Rifle 1 too. What about Mayor Pedros? He's got Assault Rifle 2! I guess we just gotta get some more 7.62 ammo. Let's see if anybody's got some on them they don't need? Super Paul's got one. Give that to Blaster. Wait, how can he not carry anything anymore? Oh, we'll trade some 45 ammo to Super Paul. Since he still uses that. That'll allow Super Paul to give him his 7.62. Fortunately, it's just one clip. You know, I think Blaster's gonna have to switch to his 45 temporarily. Just because of our ammo situation. Eight little people. Every time we pick up these clay pots, these guys show up. Don't you touch my pottery! We murder them because the pots are ours. Get out of here, little people. Except the fact that pots are for big people. Blister attacks one. Captain Rhodes attacks one. Super Paul kills one, Wolfie kills one, and so does Chris Data. Little person drills Mayor Pedros for five, knocking him out. Ooh, 45 clips. Don't mind if I do. And a pistol. Yep, we picked up another clay pot, and more of them showed up. Well, no clay pots for them. Ooh, and more gear. Ah, uh, Christina uses nine millimeters. Ah, right, we'll have to leave that throwing knife behind. I don't know if we've really accomplished much here. It was interesting exploring, to say the least. Did we check out this guy? Another half-eaten human? They were all here mining some substance. Should have been mining their own business. Uh-oh. Get out of here, Jules. We're going to have to switch the mayor to a 45 too, I think. Because he's just going through that ammo too fast. Yeah, I can't believe the mayor doesn't suck anymore. I guess anything after uh, what, what happened before with him... Oh, fuck. We only have one seven point six two left. Uh, Wolfie, unjam your weapon. Then reload it.
More little people! Get out of here. I think it said muties on there. So they're mutant little people? <laughs> Captain Rhodes blasts one in the face. Super Paul shoot one spleen out. Wolfie fires and nails a little person for 20 damage. The little people keep trying to... Oh, they knocked Mayor Pedro off again. <laughs> These little people just love beating the crap out of the mayor. I guess that does explain why... He, um... His town got taken over. Captain Rhodes weapons jams. The little people beat on the mayor's unconscious body. What stories we're gonna have. No one's gonna believe us. We went into a cave that was full of mutant midgets. And these weird monster things. Sure you did, buddy. All because we wanted to get a drunk some booze. And we got lost. I don't think they sell ammo in high pool either. Wake up, Mayor! The mayor lays unconscious of the ground as Super Paul and Wolfie kill drools. You think they call them that because they just drool everywhere? <laughs> Hi, gosh. A naked mole rat. What is this? Kim Possible? Well, this is way before Kim Possible. Alright, I guess we have to attack it. Blaster misses, Captain Rhodes misses, Super Ball hits it for 13, killing that poor naked mole rat. Well, this was an interesting trip we side trip we ended up on. There's the egg center. See, it's getting very very warm and nobody's health is going now. Hey, Lars, how you doing? Oh, I'm loving the remaster. It's been a lot of fun. I only ever played the original one for just a little bit. Oh, fuck balls. Wasteland Warriors, but the remaster has been a ton of fun. Captain Rhodes shoots the Wasteland Warrior. He's filled full of lead. Ah, could I have more lead in me? Killing him. <laughs> the Wasteland Warrior, though, before he dies, peels off a final shot, shooting and knocking the mayor unconscious once again. Alright, the whole reason for this trip, which you really didn't need to do. Scotchmo! Hobo looks at you expectantly. Let's use item. Who's got the um, snake squeezins? The hobo quickly drains the bottle of snake squeezins and drops into a trance. Then, uttering each word metronomically, he says, A steel storm threatens the city of gold. Oh, maybe that's the robots in Vegas. Let's see. I think we have more booze. That'd be better after the trip it took to get here. You don't. Oh, wrong button. I think the roads might. Oh yeah, here's some snake squeezes. Snake squeezes drip off the hobo's chin as he drains the bottle. His eyes grow distant and his voice drops an octave. To the mother who speaks in riddles comes a child of promise. Aid her, and aid justice. I have no idea what you're talking about there. That's all right. We got more booze for you, bro. That's how we like to roll. The hobo finishes the snake squeezins in record time and smiles wisely at you. He burps. One man's dream is another's nightmare. But a machine's dream is everyone's nightmare. That's the nightmare of machines we saw when we went to Vegas. Uh, let's see. Super Paul, you got any? The hobo nods to you and then drains the bottle of snake squeezes. 
twins born by the same hands, he intoned solemnly, are twins no more. Wake the sleeper to cure the sick. Kind of surprised by how many things he's got to say, which is cool. Uh, Wolfie, do you got any snake squeezins? No. Uh, Christina? She does. The hobo lowers the now empty bottle of snake squeezins and stares at you with glassy eyes. Destroy the wombs and destroy the threat. He then passes out. He then goes and punches some ladies in the stomach. That's not cool, bro! Achievement unlocked in Squeezins Veritas. I think that means we probably got all the Squeezins stuff that we can get, story-wise. That or we killed him by giving him too much booze. Yep, that's all the snake Squeezins we got anyway. Uh, maybe we'll stop by high pool and heal a second. S two slithering snakes. You made a bad choice, snakes. Blaster shoots one, killing it. Kevin Rhodes misses. Super Paul hits the other one, killing it. I guess the big question is, do we go back to Vegas now? Or go to Vegas for the first time in this save? There's one more area I want to check out, though, that's in the northeast. I don't know if our Geiger counter thing is working right or not, though. We gotta get Mayor Pedros leveled up some more. We gotta get him better armor, so he quits getting knocked out so easily. Very hot. Oh, it is working. Do you think we can run over there successfully? I have a feeling we might die, but I want to try it. Oh, that's not going to be worth it, though, because we have radiation poisoning. Why did Christina get knocked out? She had a red suit. Alright, so we'll just reload. I guess we're going to Vegas. Viva Las Vegas. Let's see if we can survive there. Wild canines appear out of nowhere and attack our awesome group. I don't think your group's awesome. What rude canines. Head Rose misses. The Super Paul shoots one, puts it down. Christina and Ace put down two others. Fine. We wanted to. Oh, shit. We're gonna have to rest here, Needles. All the damage we took falling in the river. That's all right. It's our trusty old bloody campsite. A heavy, musty smell fills the ammo bunker. Puddles of blood splash when you step in them. You can easily tell that no one comes here often. With how often we stay here, we ought to just clean it up. But I guess the plus side is nobody else is probably as desperate as us. To squat here. I 
Actually, since we're here in needles, we might as well go buy some 7.62 ammo. Because we may need that against the robots. I didn't think about that until just now. Jerks! I hate those jerks! Bunch of jerks jump on and attack us. Do you think they would learn their lesson by now? Blaster tracks the jerk and misses? Attacks. I, I looked at it wrong. I don't come over here. No, I'm attacking him, not attracting him. The jerk pounds at Christina, but her armor absorbs it. One pounds at Ace, but his armor absorbs it too. Should have seen if they had any rat suits for sale at the store. Super Paul Wolfie and Christina hitting... Uh, hit them, killing one of them. Mayor Pedros kills another one. Mayor Pedros is kind of a glass cannon. S Super Paul, you need to reload? Everyone else can shoot. Blaster and Captain Rhodes miss. Nice job by Mayor Pedros and Ace killing them. Oops, wrong place. Uh, let's see, uh, Captain Rhodes needs some 7.62. And Wolfie needs some 7.62. And then just in case this Mayor Pedros' backup weapon uses that, let's get some for him too. His inventory's full. Super Paul gets some? Just hold it for the other guys? Oh, we have pot to sell. He's gonna be disappointed when he sees it's clay pots. Here's a clay pot. Here's some hand mirrors. We, we stole from underground little people. Sworn we had more of those. Maybe I'm wrong. I'm carrying so much TNT. Oh, there's another clay pot. Like pretty. I'm really excited. Should I sell these gas masks? Fuck it. We're gonna sell a gas mask. Hopefully I won't regret that. All right, we're good. Wolfie, let's have you reload while we're at it. In fact, actually, we can have her buy one more clip of 7.62 then. Oh, maybe, maybe we can't. Well, whatever, let's get the fuck out. Now we can Viva La Vegas, Las Vegas for real. Love Vegas. I know the city. Everyone loves Love Vegas. Yeah. Every time running into those damn cactuses. Mission added. Trouble in Las Vegas. There's trouble brewing. You decide to search Las Vegas until you find out what's going on. Oh, it's a library. Super Paul can't learn anything because he's stupid, apparently. Can Mayor Pedros? Oh, Mayor Pedros has four points. Is there no medicine? Tits. I guess we could have him learn, uh... So we got bureaucracy. We'll have him learn pick lock. Do 
This wall is covered with gang names warning to other gangs. Is that a library back there? The old dusty shelves have stood here unused for more years than you've been alive. Well, at least so far we've not got bit by anything. Ah! Desert fuzzies hurt when they bounce into you. Nope, nope, nope. Oh shit! Watch out, you're being ambushed! Nine slicer dicers at ten feet. Now we'll see if we can survive these stupid things or not. Blaster hits one for three points. Captain Rhodes' gun spits out lead and hits two of them for 14 points of damage. Super Paul hits one for three points of damage. Oh god. Oh god. They womp on Christina, but the armor absorbs the damage. Same with Captain Rhodes. The mayor gets knocked the fuck out. Captain Rhodes is knocked out. Oh my god. <laughs> this does not bode well. To say the least. Captain Rhodes hits one for 12. Super Paul hits one for 12, killing it. Wolfie hits one but does no damage. Oh, unconscious. The mayor's knocked unconscious again. He just stepped up. And they knocked him back down. Super Paul's. Oh, his health was going down pretty quickly there. Blaster reloads. Ah, let's burst fire again. Blaster misses. Captain Rhodes misses. Super Paul hits one, killing him. Wolfie snaps up his shot, but doesn't do any damage. Oh, Super Paul's unconscious now, too. Oh, an ace is pretty beat up. Uh, Blaster attack. Wolfie attack. Sadly, Christina's going to have to reload. Ace is going to have to reload. He's probably going to get knocked out, though. Can he evade? Mayor Pedros. Can you reload? Blaster hits one but doesn't do any damage. Wolfie hits one only does three points of damage. Ace is knocked unconscious even though he tries to evade. So is the mayor. It's up to Blaster, Wolfie, and Christine. Blaster fires. Wolfie, Christina. Blaster hits but does no damage. Wolfie hits and does 10 damage. Uh oh, look at Wolfie's health going down. Ace wakes up, but his weapons... He needs his weapon to reload. Oops, that was the wrong one. That was Blaster. Blaster, fire! Captain Rhodes, fire off a burst shot. Wolfie, fire. Christina, fire. Ace, try to reload. You're probably gonna get knocked the fuck out of the... Blaster misses! Captain Rhodes misses! Come on, guys! Wolfie hits, but only does one point of damage. Christina hits, but does no damage. These are probably just Ron Popeil slicer dices. It slices, it dices. I just want to cut carrots. Some of our people woke up at least. Oh, you know what we ought to do? Wolfie, switch weapons. Grab some. Can you use TNT as a weapon? Blaster hits for seven. Paul hits, but doesn't do any damage. Same with Christina. Slicers miss. Slicers, oh, knock Christina unconscious. Wolfie switches, okay. We're gonna throw some TNT and see if that works. This has been a long fight. Blaster's gonna attack. Super Paul's gonna attack. Wolfie is gonna throw TNT at them. Mayor Pedros is awake. He's gonna try and reload. 
Wolfie hurls a handful of death in the slicer, but it doesn't do any damage. Oh, but it did seem to hit the other ones only for a small amount of damage, though. Super Paul got 300. They're not dead. We just went unconscious and they didn't kill us. Not like last time we were here. Can we move away from them? Into the building? Ah, uh, Wolfie, let's switch you back to your other weapon. Ah, uh, where's your M19? I don't know how in the world we escaped that. Can we just rest here? Inside as we hide from the monsters? Let's reload you, sir. Mayor Pedros, let's have... Oh, you're unconscious, so you can't reload. Now he can so have you reload your 45? I like how the robots have they just knocked us out. They left us alone. We just woke up and crawled into this building quickly before they come back. Though they'll probably be right out there when we go back out there. We did kill one or two of them. I can't say it was an overwhelming success, to say the least, though. See, past generations would have been like, I love camping! For these guys, their version of camping is living terrified in an abandoned cockroach filled house while there are killer robots outside. Someone's like, you want to go camping? No! No! I wish there was a camp until you're healed all the way button or until something shows up. Almost there. Wolfie needs one more rest. Super Paul and Blaster need a little bit more. They must be higher ranked. Alright, let's go back outside and visit those. Hopefully those robots are gone. I bet you they're going to still be there, though. Seven. We only killed two. We only killed two of them. Seven slicer dicers up here at ten feet. I thought we'd done a little better. Blaster shoots and misses. Captain Rhodes' weapon jams. Super Paul hits and does no damage. Wolfie sh hits and does three damage. Everyone else hits and does no damage. Well, this is great. Captain Rhodes is almost knocked out already. Reload. No, wait, just run. Captain Rhodes, the mayor, and Ace knocked unconscious. We just run back in the building, dragging their bodies with us. All right, that didn't work. Alright, Blaster, reload. We did better the first time. Ah, uh, Captain Rhodes, let's unjam your weapon. Reload that. Everybody missing? Probably 
probably have Super Paul reload before we go out, too. Even if we waste one bullet. Just so he doesn't have to reload as quickly. <laughs> We're going to be waiting here for another hour. We gotta rest longer. Captain Rhodes got chewed up really bad on that one. Ace did too, though. I wish we could talk to Ace, because Ace is the one who wanted us to come here to Vegas. He's the one who was like, we should investigate it because bad stuff was going down. This is next level gaming. I just have to press C each time we camp. Oh man, look at those pro stat strats. So good. Alright, Super Paul, let's reload, bro. Uh, while we're at it, let's just make sure you give another 7.62 clip to Wolfie. In case she's going to need it. Let's go back out there. What? Why did we spawn here? Oh god. Where are we? We're like clear across town. Uh, let's try to run. How much damage did we take from that? Waroid Mark III drills Wolfie for four points. One of them hit Wolfie for 23 points of damage. Commander from this side of town? One Waroid Mark I appears at 81 feet. Run! Run! Oh, shit. We're gonna run right at it. Hopefully it doesn't kill us. If not, we're gonna learn. It didn't hit anybody there, I swear. <laughs> it missed! How close are we? Uh, yeah, we'll tag it from here. Blaster misses. Captain Rhodes misses. Super Paul hits and does two points of damage. Wolfie does four. Christina does twelve. The Warroid drills Mayor Pedro's for ten points of damage. It actually didn't do too much damage that time. Uh, Wolfie, we'll have you reload. Blaster and Captain Rhodes miss. Super Paul hits, but it only does four points of damage. We're not doing a lot. Oh, Mayor Pedro's attacks hits the Warroid Mark One. For 10 points of damage, finishing it off. Hello! Hopefully the gangs don't beat us up when they find out we're in this building. Is that a tombstone in the building? Alright, we'll heal up while we're here. As we kind of run from building to building in Vegas. Trying to stay alive. I wonder if we should have gone to the Citadel first. I wonder if they would have respected us yet. Probably not. Alright, we just gotta get Wolfie heal up. Then we could run back out there and try and hide it in another building, like the brave desert rangers we are. Apparently these robots aren't scared of the legend of us shooting little people in caves. We ought to roll this tire out there. Maybe distract the robots. Alright, team, get ready to roll. Whoa. 
desert fuzzies hurt when they bounce into you. I wonder if Blaster's armor helps with that? Do you see that thing moving? Hello? The furniture in this room is only good for firewood. I have a feeling this isn't going to be worth much here. Crude pictures of nude girls and gang symbols are all over this wall. I just gotta look at this for a bit, guys. It's research, I swear. Oh, just another abandoned building. Well, Ace, Vegas is perfectly safe. There's nothing here. Let me in. <laughs> Are we just getting lucky now, or do the robots not show up at night? Ooh, a doctor! Sweet. Okay, we found the doctor's office. I think his armor might be protecting him from those things that kept giving him desert disease. Mark. F oh, these warrior things. Where are they? Oh, there they are at the intersection. Shit. I wish we could outweigh them here. Um, game, game, game. Hello, game. <laughs> Combat's over. We ran away. Game! <laughs> Stop that! <laughs> We're done with combat! Okay, we'll just quick load, I guess. Hopefully, I, I think I just saved it a moment ago. Hopefully we're not too far back. Yeah, so we checked out all those buildings. Did we check out this building? Now I'm confused! I know we checked up the other ones to the north. Boop, boop, boop. Fuck it, we'll just go south. Three scavengers appear at ten feet. How are you guys alive in the city? Serious, if your other humans alive, why do we have to fight? Blaster kills one of the scavengers. Captain Rhodes kills another one. And Super Paul kills the last one. All three of them got shots off, though. But the armor... Of our crew absorbs the shots. War droids, uh, Markoid. We're war roids. We're leaving. We're running. Run! I think it might be gaining on us. Leave us alone, you killer robot! Robot Wars has gone bad. That was such a cool show. Oh, we ran into a cactus too as we were running this way. Laster lost a point. Sorry. Trying to outrun this stupid thing. Oh, it blasted us. 
Mayor Pedros got hurt for two points of damage. Everyone else, his armor did well, absorbed it. Mayor Pedros got hit for one point of damage. Oh, that time his armor took care of it. We might have just ran into another cactus. <laughs> when death robots are on your tail, sometimes, you know, you gotta go through terrain. the library we already checked out. We already checked out this <coughs> this abandoned building. More war droids. Run! Luckily they missed. Oh, they didn't miss everyone. They knocked out the mayor. We drank his corpse. Very nice corpse. We're gonna drink his corpse. I'm still alive! Oh, I guess he woke up. The jail. Maybe we'll get some answers here. Let's save it a quick second. Hello? This building was very fancy when it was built long ago. Blockhouse, solid concrete. Freddy's men have painted up obscenities upon it. Hey! Hey, Velmax, how you been doing, man? Long time no see. Who the hell is Freddy? Steel door. A steel cell door that is, it's locked. Let's see if we can bust it open with a sledgehammer. Nope. Alright, let's use plan B. Let's blow it open. Let's blow it. Some TNT. Dino might. The trap. The floor is charged with 222 or 220 volts. Uh, what do we got? Cash, jewelry, grenade, super pole. Why should I have him take the clips? Blaster, you can take some of these clips. 9mm ones, we can spread those around. Because the mayor doesn't want that. Oh, it's good to see you, man. It's been a while. Though I took a break from streaming for like a week because I got hurt. <laughs> but I'm doing better now. It's like, ah. Let's get some, oh, I want these grenades. Grenades are fun. Plus that makes up for some of the stuff we blew up. Uh, I think we tried that. Wolfie. Alright, Christina, you got room for grenades? You do? Ace, do you? No, wuss. M Mayor Pedros? Mayor Pedros doesn't want to grab anything. Ah! Keep getting zapped by that. Casino guards? Oh, wait, we're in a casino? Hired thugs? Hired goons. I didn't realize this was a casino. Alright, let's shoot all these guards. How does anybody run a casino in a city run by killer robots? Oh, that's awesome, Velmax. Have they come out with a price point for the PS5 yet? Ah, uh, keep shooting. Uh, let's get some of these thugs, too. Blaster kills one of the casino guards. Captain Rhodes drops another. Super Paul hits one for three points of damage. Wolfie blasts, uh, I think it was a thug? Mayor Pedros is knocked unconscious, like always. Blaster misses a thug. Captain Rhodes has another kill on him. 
Yeah, I thought they might announce it at E3. I don't think Sony's... Is Sony doing E3 this year? I don't think they are. Of course, there might not be an E3 this year because of the disease. Try to blast these hired guns and these thugs. Blaster misses. Captain Road misses. Super Paul hits one, but only for five points of damage. Wolfie hits one, but doesn't do any damage. Luckily, they're not doing a lot of damage to anyone outside of the mayor. Reload. Uh, reload. Kill that stupid thug and the hired goons. Did they cancel E3, though? I thought E3 they were still discussing. All right, hired guns, it's your time to die. People must have real gambling issues if they have to sneak into the edge of Vegas with the killer robots just to gamble. Uh-oh, Captain Rhodes got knocked out. These guys are not doing a lot of damage to these hired guns. Super Paul did like five points of damage to one. Blaster misses. Super Paul hits one, but doesn't do any damage. Wolfie does hit one, killing it. The crazy times we live in with all the stuff getting canceled because of that. Reload your weapon there. Not that I blame folks for that. Captain Rhodes kills one. Super Paul hits one, but doesn't do any damage. Christina hits one, but doesn't do any damage. Mayor Pedros attacks. The hired gun, gun and does five points of damage. The hired gun blazes away at Pedros. Mayor Pedros, but his armor protects him. Wolfie reloads. These are the first humans in a while that have given us difficulty. Blister attacks the hired gun and misses. Captain Rhodes triggers. And one hired gun is raked in a crossfire of bullets for four points of damage, killing them. Oh, and there's gear. Oh man, a bunch of stuff. Take 69 cash, nice. Uh, we don't really need the pistols. We could use the 45s clips though. We can definitely use the nine millimeter clips. Also, ever nobody can carry them. They only hire the gun, the person doesn't come with it. Or the, maybe the gun brings the person with it. Oh, there's somebody in prison there. Blockhouse, solid. Oh, we already saw this. Who wants the loot? It's a book. We're not a bunch of nerds. I just don't think we have room for it. The binding threatens to splinter apart as you take the book in your hands. The pages have warped into stiff yellow curves through contact with liquids. Some pages at the beginning have been torn out. Where the writing begins, it's a crude scrawl with some letters written backwards. Deciphering is no easy task. Luckily, it's fairly short, so you persevere. The Secrets of Las Vegas. My name is Dave Dawkins. I found this old empty book. And I'm going to write down all my secrets, in case I forget them. I'm a guard for Fat Freddy. He's number two in Vegas, and he wants to be number one. There's a big reward for anyone who can kill Farron Brigo, the big boss. Brigo stays hidden most of the time. My hair is starting to fall out. I wonder if it's because I joined the servants of the Mushroom Cloud. It gives me a good feeling to be with my new friends in the temple. They told me the secret password. It's three letters. N. R. C. Nurk. A lot of the servants are bald. Maybe I will be too. Lately, there's been a lot of fighting. I try to hide, but where is it safe? Robot death machines are the worst. Our guns don't always kill them, suckers. Freddy says we need better weapons, and that's why we gotta find this Max guy. I didn't say nothing. I'm afraid to tell him that the servants say Max is captured by the cyborgs. I'm looking at my words, and this is okay, and I'm proud. 
I didn't know I could write so good till I tried it. I will write again later. Here the writing breaks off. From what you know of the Vegas situation, the diary can't be more than a week or two old. But Dave apparently didn't come back. We also know, which we didn't know before, that there are cyborgs involved. Also, apparently if you're bald, you're in the cult of the mushroom... What was that? Cult of the mushroom, whatever. Which must mean I'm in that, because I'm bald. NRC is a password to somewhere. But I don't know if that's in Vegas. There's that place in um, Needles that needs a password we couldn't get into. And then Farron Brygo, that's one of the developers' name uh, that they rearranged for the character, Brian Fargo. So let us save a second. I almost didn't pick that book up. I didn't think it was important. Hey, Blaster, I only picked up the book because there was room. I was just like, does anybody got fucking room for this nerd book? I didn't realize it was a plot point. So we just found out from that that this, there's some dude named Max. There are cyborgs that have kidnapped Max. That guy was in the mushroom ser service of the mushroom cloud, and their password is NRC, which I don't know if you use needles or if, if it's anywhere in the mushroom cloud temple. We already fucked that up. Things are going better, Blaster. How, how are things going for you? And we know that this guy that wrote this was a guard for Fat Freddy. And there's a big reward for killing Fair and Brygo. Alright, let's see if we can go help whoever's in that room. How do we get in there? There ain't no door. Oh, the door is marked Danger Prisoners Within. There are two buttons. One marked open, one marked closed. It's open. The concrete slab slowly descends into the floor and opens the cell. Oh, I hope you had a good time at the family gathering. There's a man chained to the wall. It's Covenant. He's been captured by Fat Freddy. Get me loose, says the prisoner. Alright, prisoner, I hate to break it to you. I really hate to break it to you. But the thing is, we've kind of... When we need to pick a door, pick a lock, open a door, we've kind of used dynamite or grenades or TNT. And so I don't think we've learned how to pick locks because we've had the cool explosive way. Now, if you don't mind standing there, maybe we could use some TNT to blow these cuffs off. I think we might have given somebody... Let's see if we gave somebody a skill and picking locks because we gave somebody a skill in something. Um, can we throw a knife at you? I don't see anybody with pick locks. I could have sworn I was going to give somebody it. Oh, I did. I gave it to the mayor. All right. So, um, let's see if you'll, some, he might not do it though. Sometimes these guys don't. So we'll go to use, Mayor Pedro, skill, pick lock. The mayor just, God damn it, Mayor Pedros. We're like, Mayor Pedros, could you just unlock this? Get me loose, says the prisoner. And he's like, no, I'm not doing it. Why did I give you points in pick lock if you weren't going to do it? He did it. I guess we pressured him enough. You did it. You freed me. I think... I'll say this. I think we got to get him to join our group. To do that, it means we probably have to dismiss someone. Fuck. Yep, everybody's still alive. We're hiding in Vegas. Uh, we got the shit kicked out of us in Vegas. Do you have Ebony762? Can you trade that to Wolfie? Wolfie, does, he doesn't want to... Like, who do we get rid of? I'm not getting rid of Christina. 
They should join the posse. I'm pretty sure I have to get this guy to join us, though, if he's plot important. So I just saved it. We will try and tell the mayor to leave. You know what, mayor? You did a good job. You're our only guy who can pick locks. Go back to the city. We taught him how to fight. We fought some robots, and they kicked the crap out of us. We killed, like, two, and then we had to run. Go back to... Well, where is he from? Quartz? We have taught you how to fight, Pedro. Now you can go back to Quartz and lead them and not get your ass kicked by any other ugly gangs. Alright, so let us try... Um, I think it's Encounter. One Covenant appears at 10 feet. Let's hire him. Everybody will try. We'll re if, if this isn't the guy we hire, we'll just reload and get the mayor back. Woo, thanks! I didn't think I'd ever get out of that one. What? Is there any point to that? Oh, fuck it. We're just leaving him here, then. I'm just gonna quick load and keep the mayor. Unless we get... You know, if we run into somebody who says, I, I need you to find this guy, whatever. What was that? You're free! Good luck, buddy. Oh, can we use charisma on you? It doesn't seem to work for anything. You're free! Ah, we don't need that. Well, we don't need it, but I wish we could take that. Uh, there's a couple different ways to join the posse. Your f top four characters you make. And technically, if they die, you can go back to Ranger Command and make a new one. The other ones, you have to walk into and hire them. You just, uh, when you're in a combat encounter, you say, you try to hire them, and then they join you if they want to. War rights. Ten cyborg commandos. That is a funny picture. That is a. <laughs> oh man, I would not want to join that military. <laughs> We're gonna make you into a bike. It's not as cool as it seems. Oh god. We're dead. Run! Even people with good armor are fucked. This is about to be a total party wipe right here. More of them! Uh, it's the same ones, but... Like, this is the first time we've run into these things, too. Alright, we're, we're just gonna reload. <laughs> I thought those other ones were bad. The mar Marco war Warroids? One more raid. Mark three. Oh, those aren't even Mark ones. Nope, nope, nope. Five radioactive vermin appear at 10 feet. Oh, and aces beat the fuck up. We don't have time for this vermin. Stupid shit rats. Where was the hospital in town? Can't remember if it was on the west side or the east side. Fuck it, we're gonna have to reload. I think Ace might be already injured though in it.
All these are empty. Oh, there's some more roids right there. Sniper droid, slicer dicers, a chopper. Run! You know what? Fuck it. We're gonna go to a different part of the map for a while. Ah! <laughs> Slither and Iguana, don't you even try us. We just fought a bunch of robots. You are not a problem. Blister attacks and kills one for 20 points of damage, killing him. Was it just one of them? <laughs> the river below you is a torrent waiting to suck you down. Whoa. Stay appropriate, river. Oh shit. He's just got radiation poisoning. That just heals naturally, right? <laughs> Walk too close to that. Can we wash it off if we go into a stream? You're knee deep in High Pool Creek. The water is cool, but the rocks are slippery. <laughs> they won't heal at all when they have radiation. Poo poo. For some reason, the, uh, what do you call it? The radiation detector thing wasn't detecting the radiation like it was supposed to. The Geiger counter. It counted no Geigers. Let's go to the Citadel and see if it's, if we're too early to go here. The defender on the wall yells, leave, wasteland scum. You're not old enough to die here. All right. We take a hint. We can take a hint. I guess we'll rest at high pool. Oh, there is something else. We'll rest at high pool. And then we'll see if that password works in needles. It probably doesn't. The one that we found in the book. I want to say NCR, but it's NRC. NCR goes for a different game. All right, we can save it here. See, now we can see the radiation. Is there a way we can go through just one? No, no matter what, we have to go through two things. You see a broken Jeep. Ace, it fixes the Jeep and you're on your way? After a long journey, your jeep sputters and wheezes and finally stops, luckily in a gas station. The jeep is broken and needs to be fixed. That was weird. How many times did we go by the jeep? Hey, can you fix my jeep? Hey, yeah, is your jeep busted? You want me to fix it? Yes? Yeah, the engines are scarce these days. I'll hold the jeep to you till you want it fixed. I gotta go get an engine for it. They sell engines in um, needles, I think. Oh, is it needles or quartz? Oh. <laughs> 
Captain Rose weapon just jabs. It's kind of interesting though. When we got ace last time when we were coming out of there, I guess I didn't look at the jeep. We just walked by it. Stupid jacks. Go back to your junk family. All I'm trying to do is go see if I can buy an engine. Alright, Blaze, let's have you reload, good sir. And we'll have Mayor Pedros do the same. You won't believe the jerks I had to deal with today. Alright, uh, we got some shit to sell over here, too. Hand mirror, jewelry. Do you have the engine? I could have sworn it was him. Was there only one engine? Isn't this where we bought the engine for uh, High Pool? And it was like 500 bucks? Maybe I'm wrong and it was Quartz. I don't remember there being a salesperson in Quartz, though. I swear it was here. This looks like a private club. An eyeball appears in the hole of the wall. You hear what's the password? Let's try the password. NRC? Blow off. All right, that wasn't it. Just leave me alone, you jerks. The leather jerk whomps on Captain Rose. Oh, no, you didn't. All right, that's how you want to do it? Nobody hits the desert rangers and gets away with it anymore. Well, unless you're a killer robot, then you probably do get away with it. I need an engine for my Jeep, you jerks. Yeah, I swear it was here. Maybe you have the choice then. You can either use it for that or you can use it for high pool. Or maybe I'm missing that there's one else. We're going to run out of quartz anyway a second. Let's see if I'm wrong. Oh, Super Paul, you need to reload. What are you thinking about, son? Yeah, we're trying to find a new engine. Because we got the Jeep to work. Ace fixed it temporarily to get us to the gas station here. And he's like, you need a new engine. I see your Jeeps. You might have fixed it? Yes, but engines are scarce. So we're trying to find a new engine for it. And I thought... We bought one there. Let's go. Oh, shit. Let's cross the bridge because I don't want to get all our people drowned. Not everybody can swim. Was there a store here? Rib crackers. Well. Mayor Pedro's town is the same as always. Super Paul kills one. Wolfie kills another one. Christina kills a third. I remember how these guys used to wreck us. I do. That's the um bar. The stagecoach inn is like right here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was the needles where we bought that engine. Poo poo! Wait, there is a store down here though. More rib crackers. Dude, I'm just trying to go shopping, brother. 
Do you not interrupt me when I'm in my shopping mood? Blaze during Captain Road shoot and miss. Super Paul and Wolfie hit. Wolfie kills one. Christina kills one. Ace kills one. And the mayor murders one. He's angry that they've infiltrated his town. That's the wrong one. Yep, definitely. Yeah, there must have been just one engine. I don't know if we could steal it from High Pool, but that seems like that would be mean. No water for you. We want to ride around in our cool Jeep. I wonder if there's a plot reason to have that though. I wonder if like if you fix it you can drive into that one place with the um radiation around it quicker. <laughs> it's how you rebuild society by rebuilding the economy. Nope. I gotta watch out for those killer bike commandos. Four slicer dicers appear at 10 feet. We're being ambushed. We might be able to take on four. That might be wishful thinking, too. Super Blaster hits one for only two points. Captain Rhodes misses. Super Paul hits but does no damage. Wolfie hits only does four points of damage. Mayor Pedro's weapon jams. Ah, as he screams, oh no, it's happening again! Only we could ride these things. Wait, Blaster, do you have... Fuck. Uh, Blaster, attack. Captain Rhodes, attack. First shot, Super Paul. You got a rocket, grab that. Wolfie attack, Christina attack, Ace attack, Pedro unjam your weapon, man. Blaster attacks and does no damage. Captain Rhodes misses. Wolfie hits and does do eight damage. Oh, Captain Rhodes taking a bunch of hits. Mayor Pedro taking some. <laughs> All right, Blaster attack. Captain Rhodes attack. Super Paul's got out his law rocket. It's time to lay down the law. Blaster misses. Captain Rhodes misses. Super Paul. Oh, misses with the rocket. We only have a limited amount of those that we got in the cultist place. And he just blasts one and misses one. Hey, loud go. How goes it? That just. Captain Rhodes is knocked out. Blaster reloads. Super Paul, grab your pistol. Wolfie, uh, grab a grenade. Christina, attack. Ace, reload. Mayor Pedros, attack. Vote for Pedros. Not much. We're just getting our ass kicked here in Vegas. We got the Jeep to work outside of Needles. Ace fixed it, and then he drove it to... Uh, that gas station, you know that gas station with that guy who just slept there and never did anything? And then the thing broke down and he's like, well, I'll fix it if you get an engine. And we don't have any engines for it. And we went to the place where we bought one before and they didn't have one. Uh, Blaster reload. Super Paul attack. Or, uh, you attack. Super Paul. Attack. Wolfie, throw that grenade. Christina, attack. And then the other two are unconscious. Rose misses. Super Paul hits and does no damage. Wolfie throws a grenade. Ooh, that did some real damage to the slicers. In fact, it killed one of them. So, grenades seem to be more effective than TNT. Now, Blaster attack. Super Paul attack. Wolfie attack. She's got another grenade. Blaster misses. Super Paul hit one, killing it. Wolfie hurls another grenade, killing two more. 
Wolfie got a bunch of experience there. Let's see. Hopefully she upgraded. Come in, High Command. Nobody gets a promotion. Come on, are you kidding me? Do you know how hard we worked for this? High Command, not very supportive. Uh, we will rest in here a moment. <laughs> Captain Rose and Pedros wakes up, confused as to where they are. Wake up in a stinky abandoned building. Oh, Ace needs to reload too. I almost missed that. Oh, why has he got all these M19 rifles? I need to go sell some of those. He's going to have to start throwing rifles at people. He's got so many of them. See, you don't have to go outside to see the fall colors here. It's the nice fall colors of Las Vegas. So I wonder if those robo, those bike commandos count as cyborgs or if they're different cyborgs that book was talking about. But I wouldn't give for a medic in our group. Maybe I should have picked up that constant dude and seen what skills he had. Alright, two more people to fill up. Super Paul needs just like one or two more rests. Only one more sleep till Robo Christmas. Come on, Captain Rhodes. Alright, there we go. I'm going to save it because I don't... Ooh, why can't I save it? There we go. Quickly run to the other building. <laughs> Wait, this building looks different. I've not seen one like this before. Hello? No! God damn it. I think Blaster might have rabies again. He just got bit by something. No, a scorpion fell on you and I could have stung you. Oh, he's poisoned. There is a doctor somewhere. There is a hospital in town. We know that. No, no, no. Slicer Dicers. We're going to the doctors. Try using a door. Try using a door. Oh god, we're surrounded. He's just trying to get him to a doctor's. This might be a hospital. This isn't the hospital though. Oh he stepped oh no, there's more! Run! I wish we could just rest and have the poison naturally, like, run its course. I wish we could hack those things. I don't think there's a hack skill, is there? Run! This is... Run! 
We need, like, laser weapons or something to deal with these sniper droids and these other things. Sniper droids miss! <laughs> oh, I want to go into this building. Three thug thugs appear at ten feet. These are the guys I'd be scared of. If if they can survive in this environment, like how bad of an S of a thug do you have to be, or how stupid? Maybe stupid because we're killing them pretty easily. Nope, nope, nope. Shit. Oh, man. Attack, it's right next to us. Is this a... Oh, these are sniper droids. Blazer hits one for seven points. Captain Rhodes hits them for 15. These might not be so bad close up. They blaze away at Ace. Two of them miss. Too bad we can't rip an engine out of one of these. Put it into our Jeep. Or like, Dragon Ass was saying, hack it and then just ride around on it. Uh, kept roads fire. Super Paul reload. Oh, thanks for the subscription, Lauren. How are you doing? Attack, fools, attack! Blaster, Captain Rhodes! Super me! Wolfie! How's it going, Lauren? I'm doing alright, thanks for asking. I gotta catch a tiny bit of your stream yesterday, it was fun to watch. Alright, let's call HQ and see if we get an upgrade. Yeah, maybe next week or the week after, if y'all have some time, maybe play Red Dead if the new update didn't break it. Sorry I've not been around. I missed like a week. I wanted to finish this last week, but I threw my back out like last Monday or Tuesday. And so I literally spent a week in bed. Today's like the first day where I've been out of bed for any considerable length of time. Oh, nobody's ready for promotion, sadly. Yeah, it was unpleasant. Yesterday I sat up for a couple hours and I was like, whoa, I'm really pushing it. And then today, today's been a lot better. On the plus side, it gave me some time to catch up on reading. Um, we're going to go to a different doctor's. Do they have a... Oh, yeah, yeah, they have a doctor right over here. Don't they? Yeah, yeah, right there. I think that building's the doctor's. So we can heal Blaster. Oh wait, first of all, we gotta s give him the money. Oops, wrong button. Because otherwise then the doctor's like, oh no. Blaster needs an exam. He's got a bug bite. He needs to have it cured. Thanks, Doc. We're gonna go rest in our creepy bunker. Oh, thanks for sharing the sub, Lauren. Uh, what are we doing? Camping? Very sub miss. Yeah, the only thing I ended up playing video game wise, because I couldn't sit here where I do all my stuff, is I did get to play some of um, Pokemon Shield, because luckily, you know, the Switch is portable. It's one of the few times I've actually used it in the portable mode. In fact, Lauren was doing a Pokemon stream yesterday. That was a pretty cool shiny you got. I don't need a Ponita, but thanks. I didn't catch that part. I caught the beginning when you um, evolved your shiny Magikarp into, uh, what is it, Gyarados? And then I saw a little bit of the pony breeding.
Like a shiny Vulpix or it's rare like it had a disease or something where it... Oh, an ice Vulpix? Cool. That game's a lot of fun. I've been meaning to get back to it, but just been doing other things. Well, and then I was injured. And then when this came out, I've had so much fun with this game. I wanted to beat this game last week, but like I said, since I was out of commission, unfortunately, I didn't get to. Did you get that in trade, or did you find that one, Lauren? <sighs> Let's look at our journal a moment. All it says is there's trouble brewing in Vegas. You decide to search Vegas until you find out what's going on. Well, that's a pretty good trade, then. Please don't show up, robots. I just want to look through town. This is something. Not been here. Spades Casino. Oh, fuck. Hi. People with money are always welcome here. Oh, well, we definitely have money. I didn't get anybody the gambling skill. This hallway is shabby and well used. It looks more like an entrance to a fort than the legendary Spades Casino. Hookers. Inside of Space Casinos, even more run down the hallway. The rugs are worn through and the walls are in need of a new coat of paint. Everybody's got guns. Hi! Don't mind us. Sure, you can play, but we only have room for one more. Does somebody have gamble? I don't think anybody does, so let's go skills. I should have given someone gamble. I was like, that's a fun skill. No Ooh, Lauren's got gamble. And she's got good luck, I think. She does. Alright, so we're gonna save to make sure I don't fuck this up. We're gonna have Wolfie. Did I do that right? No, I did that wrong. <laughs> Alright, there's Wolfie right there. Yeah, you were a blue before, I think. So this is our main group. This is Wolfie. So Wolfie can sit down by herself. <laughs> Luckily, I found this out in the bar. People with money are always welcome here. Sure, you can play, but we only have room for one more. It's a high-low game played with dice. The player rolls the die, and then the dealer rolls the die. If the player rolled higher than the dealer, he wins. The bet is $10 per roll. Would you like to play high-low? All right, Wolfie, win this. You don't have enough money to... I think Blaster has all our money. All right, let's give the money to Wolfie. Don't lose it all. Let's try that again. <laughs> you lose. Better luck next time. Fuck this game. You lose. You lose. You lose. You lose. This game is rigged. We haven't won a single time. Well, that was useless. We just lost a bunch of money. Uh, let's let's set our order back up. Who's Blaster was first, right? And then Captain Rhodes, Super Paul Wolfie, and then yeah. Chandelier looks as if it's gotten stuck in the center of several gunfights. Can move and play. You can't win if you can't play. 
All right, let's disband again. Wait, no, I didn't do it right. Three card Monty was played here with three cards. <laughs> no, we're not playing three card Monty. Three card Monty is a scam. Don't ever play three card Monty. You like to play the slot machine? Okay. Lights flash, bells ring, and bells and cherries and lemons go spinning. Sorry you lose. Hmm. Well, it's a typical casino. You stand at the bar hoping to get a drink and wait and wait. Can I get a complimentary drink with all the money we've lost already? Finally, a pit boss comes over to you. The pit boss sends a stream of brown saliva from between his front teeth to the tip of your boots. He slowly sucks on the tobacco pocketed between his cheek and gum. As he continues to eye you, working a finger into his mouth, he scoots the chew around and finally breaks the silence. See, Cram, the manager? He says with a long drawl. You note this in your journal. Hi, they call me Crumb, he says with a nod of his head. After he exchanges handshakes with everybody, he tells you, See Farron Brigo? He's my boss. Be sure to use the password Kestrel. As you leave, he yells, Tell him I sent you. Who were you again? Brian Fargo. I mean, Farron Brigo. Kestrel. All right, we'll save that. Oh, I don't want Wolfie number one because she's got a rifle. Blaster, Captain Road, Super Paul, Wolfie. There we go. Oh, wait, there's one more. Oh, no, we can't. There's somebody there. Oh, wait, no, there's a seat right here. Never mind, I shouldn't have disordered things. Poo -poo. Oh, wait, no, it's three card money again? They're both three card money? Fuck that shit. Just might as well just give them my money. Alright, so how do we go talk to. This wood door, wooded steel door is locked. Look, there's only one way I know how to get in here. Oh wait, can the mayor lock pick it? They're all staring at us though. Can Wolfie lock pick it with her sledgehammer? No. Can Captain Rhodes lock pick it with some TNT? This guy doesn't look friendly! One roving guard appears at 14 feet. A card shark appears at 28 feet. I, I don't know if that's what I want to do. I don't know if that's what I want to do. We're going to quick load. We're just taking a peek, you know, as you do. Where'd everybody go? They're all there. Oh, they're there. We just needed to spawn in a second. Oh, there's a way down there, too. I don't know if we can go down there, though, because I don't see any way through the bar. How odd. Manager of Spades Casino, Crumb, told you to find his boss, Fair and Brigo, to use the password Kestrel, telling his guards that Crumb sent you will help you gain access. So who do I fucking tell that to? Kestrel! Castro! 
It's like, you don't understand. I don't, I don't understand what you meant, dude. Use the password Pestrel, telling his guards that Crumb sent you will help you gain. Well, we're already in here. Well, how do I get through there, then? Unless we blow that door open. The mayor can't... I mean, I guess we could have the mayor try to lockpick it again. That didn't seem to work. Mayor Pedro disobeys you. God damn it, Mayor Pedro. Pick this lock. Sorry, Ranger, but the door is still closed. Mayor Pedro, I will slap you. He disobeys me. Mayor Pedro's! We're getting sick of your shit, Mayor. Oh, what was that? Here, Pedro is getting blown up. They must have those to protect them. Oh, look, there's these flags over here. Oh, no, no, no. Oh shit, I gotta reload it. The mayor got fucked up. <laughs> it's cause I was running them through the minefield. <laughs> Can't we walk around? Nope, Mayor Pedros, you go first. Oh, I just wanna walk around. Walk. I wanna go upstairs though. Fuck it. Oops! Kestrel! 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 I'm using the secret word! Kestrel! Lady of peasants. The young lady is offended by the way you're looking at her. <laughs> Sorry I looked at you, lady. I'm sure, I'm sure everything went fine there. Let's see if uh, Wolfie can use her lock picking skills to open this up with her sledgehammer. No. To the mayor? Oh, he doesn't even. Oh, fuck. Alright, mayor, you don't want to? Do you have anything explosive on you? No. Alright, then Captain Rhodes can do it. Don't climb on that table. I'll climb where I want, game. Why is the bathroom locked like that? Let's go up here. Hello? Does it... Wait, there's no point in coming up here. This must not be the area where... We... Oh, wait, what's that? Maybe there is something up here. I'm glad I bought off the stupid TNT. One cutie appears at 44 feet. The Max 17 looks awfully big in the cute girl's hand. Hey, y'all! I'm a cutie! Shoot that cutie. Blaster misses. Captain Rose doesn't care about cuties, though. Plugs her in the head for 23 points of damage. Super Paul misses. I can't hit a cutie. Wolfie don't give no fuck about cuties. Shoots her in the brain, splattering her brains all over the place, killing her. Y'all, hardcore. Uh, Max 17 MS or SMG. Some 45 clips. Super Paul and Blaster can use those. Leave the knife over there. Alright, we need more TNT. I bought so much of this because I didn't learn how to pick locks, so I was like, what's this buy dynamite? That's cool. The old boarded over shaft goes down into the darkness below. Uh, do I use a rope for that? I know we got some rope still. The rope tied overhead goes down to the hole at your feet and stretches out of sight. 
I'll climb down the motherfucking rope. Why won't they use the rope? Do we have to use climb? Use Captain Rhodes' um, skill climb? There we This game is awesome. Kestrel? <laughs> Kestrel! <laughs> Kestrel? <laughs> the brick walls of this place make it look like a fortress. Scared about the floor is rubble, junk, and trash. Soundproof door is made of steel and aluminum. Oh, place needs to reload. Well, let's just see if we could knock on this door with some TNT. Oops! What was the point of any of this? The graffiti scrawl reads, Tin Man was here. <laughs> this was all... What? Your way is blocked by rock halls, so... Old, it's hard as cement. The rubble blocking your way looks like it could be dug out of the way. Oh, we have a shovel still. Luckily, we kept that. Does Captain Rhodes have it? Oops. Well, that was interesting and useless. <laughs> hey, guys, I'd never blow up a door or kill anyone just to see what's behind that door. I don't care. Kestro, Kestro, Kestro. Gotta go. What's up, hooker? Yeah, hey, let's play the slots. We don't have enough money to play. We're going to get Wolfie one more try on the slots. Sorry, you lose. Well, it's, it's casino shit. Well, someday we'll figure out where to use the damn password. A swarm of insects buzzes towards you. 14 animals appear at 20 feet. Wait, they're cuties too? Your definition of cutie is very... It's much wider than mine would have been. Blaster hits one. Captain Rhodes misses. Super Paul hits one. Killing it. Wolfie kills one. Christina kills one. Ace kills one. Mir Pedro kills one. I hope they don't get his disease us. Uh, reload, Blaze. This is different, though. We've not run into this kind of uh, art yet in the game. Happy Rose kills one. Super Paul kills one. Wolfie kills one. Christina kills one. So does Ace and the mayor. Blaze to reloads. Well, these guys haven't been much of a threat. Super Paul and Wolfie put down the last ones. Blockhouse solid concrete. Freddy's men have painted obscenities on the wall. I thought this building would be different. From the outside, it definitely is different than any of the other ones we've seen. No! Slice the dices.
Leave us alone, you damn robos. Try using a door. I'm trying to find out where the door is, game. How do I get in there? Apparently you don't get in there? Nope, 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 nope. Nope, 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 nope. Well, where the hell do we use the damn password? What's this building? Is this the hospital? Yeah, there's the hospital. It's gonna have a special name. The building we gotta go into. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Oh, don't do this game. Don't do this. Oh, every once in a while, locals must throw all the trash in the building. Stuff is trying to get out the door. Poop, 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 poop. No. I guess we'll have to load up. For once in a while, it gets stuck in the battle screen like that when you switch locations during a battle. Well, where the hell do we go now? There was, like, nothing else for the Vegas there. What was that? Hmm. Slay Whoa, there's a slicer dice. Did was this in gambling? Do they let them gamble here? Captain Rhodes, attack it, Super Paul. I'm just going to win some. Oh shit, humans! Captain Rhodes shoots it for seven points of damage. Super Paul does for three. Wolfie sh shoots into the slicer for six points of damage, killing it. That's the easiest we've ever killed one of these things. Oh no! Leave me alone, death tank! Trying to shoot us up the butthole. Not cool, bro. Not cool. Alright, Wolfie, we'll have you reload. Probably running out of 7.62 clips. I think Vegas is what we have to do. Though. Oh, get out of my face, Wasteland Warriors. We just fought a bunch of robots. You think we care about some damn desert hobos? If that was the robot's vacation. Ah, finally a break from roboting. Evil robot stuff. I can't wait to gamble. The other robots will be like, it's so sad. He saved up a long time for that trip. This damn hobo won't die. How many games do you get to save that in? <laughs> Wolfie finally finishes one of them off. How many warriors are there? I just got an achievement for something about shooting wasteland warriors. Captain Rhodes kills one. The mayor kills one. I didn't look to see how many there were. Sometimes we're the bad guys. Good, bad, we're the ones with the guns. Have yeah, the Rose kills once. Wolfie kills one. Are we done with these stupid ass wasteland? 
dipshits. Call in for promotions from Ranger Center. Wolfie's achieved the rank of Lance Corporal Wolfie. You get two adventure points. Let's give you... Let's give you a point in IQ and a point in Dexterity. Yeah, the dog was rabid and the kid was an asshole. Now, admittedly, the first time we played this, on the first save, not the current one, we might have shot a bunch of kids up just because they laughed at us when we came into town. Possibly. I don't know. You damn leather thugs! Looking so sexy in your leather clothes! Though you look like you're wearing a Canadian tuxedo, actually, but... Wolfie kills one. Super Paul hits one. So does Blaster. All right, let's go to the library. Uh, Wolfie. Oh, you only got one skill point for that. Nobody can learn the medic skill. Can the doctor teach it? Is that just one you have to create a character with? <laughs> that reminds me of a Kids in the Hall sketch where Dave Foley plays a doctor. He's got blood all over him. He's like, I don't know what I'm doing. All right, Geiger Counter, are you working? No, it's not. Uh, maybe if we run into Desert Nomad's area a second and then run out? What's up, Breakman? Heal the monster! I'm monstrous, I am! Ooh, scary! Cat Road shoots the Heal monster! Wolfie shoots it. Christina misses. Or, I think she hit but didn't do any damage. That's like when we started at Egg Center, we got beat up by everything. Blaster attacks the Gila monster, doing nine points of damage, killing the thing. Got 240 hit points for that. Is that enough to get him over the... Nope. I want to go here. We're just going to run. That's how radiation works, right? You just run right through it. No. That's not how it works. Uh, thanks, Lord. Try to run right through it. We need more armor, too. Let's see if they got better armor and needles. I didn't think they did, but... Blister shoots him doing 16 points of damage. Captain Rhodes shoots another one doing 22 points of damage. Ace finishes one of them off. I guess it was only one of them. Desert Nomad. If he's Nomad, why is he, like, all angry at us? Blister shoots the Nomad for 20 points, killing them instantly. He's like, get a home. A lost soul. Can you tell me how to get around? You will die, lost soul. No, I just need directions. We'll give you directions to hell. Get roads triggers. And one lost soul is raked in a crossfire bullets for 23 points of damage, killing them. Seriously, leather jerks, just fuck off. Wow, they hit us pretty hard. Fine. You know what, leather jerks? You gonna do that? Then fine, we will wreck you. We we're gonna roll, we we're gonna play nice. Wolfie was out of ammo, so she just beat the person. Reload. Reload. 
Maybe Kestrel works over here. I don't know. Listen without your headphones then. Blaster. We're gonna reload. Fucking jerks, I'm just trying to go to the store. Mayor Pedro's unjam. Alright, what was I doing in the store? I don't even remember why I came over here now. After all this. Well, I can try I can try restarting the stream a second. Give me just a second. 